So let's get an iPhone. And we'll start with that, okay? Uh, here we can use uh, we can use two different skins. We have this one, which is kind of rough, and this is a little more polished. I suggest we stick with the sketch skin for now because otherwise we might get enamored of the look and feel too much. Uh, the idea here is to really um, uh, do things and throw them away and do them again if we need to. Okay. It's ugly, okay. It's ugly on purpose. All right. Okay. So, uh, let's see. Bellies abroad. Is that what it's called? Like that, or one word, or? Uh, well, we the obviously uh, the, the website is obviously all word, but right. But but the brands, do you know? Yeah, do you care? No, I'm not caring quite yet. Okay. All right. Let's leave it like that for now. So I would suggest uh, a little tagline here, a little something, uh, the best we can resource for um, abroad. No, um, what to expect when you're next expat? I don't know if it's very, it's, it's, um, if it's descriptive enough. Uh, okay. Well, we, can, we can look for that. What to expect? Being pregnant gives you a whole new vocabulary. What do you do when you have to learn it in a whole new language? Also, Too much. Also good. Basically, this is the like uh, expat moms. Uh, this is not only for moms though it's also for uh, uh for pregnant women pregnant women right yep expecting as an expat uh new expat mom find medical professionals here find can we use health care instead of medical thank you <laughs> Trying to change the paradigm slowly, slowly. Me, healthcare professional here. How about that? Um, Fantastic. Or, uh, okay. Well, this this could be a start. Uh, it could be it could be rewritten. Uh, we'll, we'll look at it again. But basically, this is like. Who are you? Are, do you match? <laughs> you know, are you someone who's interested? In, otherwise, go away, right? Okay. Exactly. Expect expecting, uh, or uh, or you, I don't know, something like that. Then we say, okay, here's the value proposition of this whole thing. You're gonna find local. No, it's not local. Uh, yes, it is local. The MVP will definitely be local. But what about the online ones? I'm sorry, what about what? The online ones, the video, the online talks, is still a local doctor. Yes, they're still local doctors. Okay, who speak your language? How about that? Mm hmm. Because I think that's the main problem, right? Because they could, they, could, they could ask around for a doctor, but they can't find a doctor who speaks their language, or also maybe, I mean, what do they have that's special, these providers that you have? Um, they are working in the best interest of mother and child. They are not economically compromised. They are not uh, offering health services at higher costs or, or giving, uh, uh, performing procedures that are unnecessary for economic gain and um, are aware of World Health Organization guidelines. Right. That's a whole lot. Yeah, that's a lot to say. So how about this? <laughs> Vetted local healthcare professionals. Here, we are already- Vetted? Here. I don't know, is that a bad word? Uh, selected? Sure. Uh, filtered? Uh, 
don't responsible, know. Uh, ethically uncompromised. Well, I, I think here you want to say people we've chosen, right? Yes. Um, our uh, our network of local healthcare professionals. Yeah, but that, then it means who are you? I have to trust you. Don't you already? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Yet. I just I just came to this, to this, you know, like it's too soon. Um, here we could do like highly recommended. How about that? You know what, though? I mean, it, it, this is an interesting thing, and I'm not sure that uh, we need to lose time today um, thinking of it, but one of my, the big things is, is that we are going to have a creed, and our healthcare professionals are going to follow that creed, and it is using fact-based research and World Health Organization guidelines, um, but that ethically uncompromised element of our doctors, because one of the issues that I am trying to confront with this site is when you are in a new city and say for example you go to your embassy to ask for a healthcare professional they have a list of doctors that are on that list for the sole reason that they speak english i don't believe that's a good enough criteria perfect this is very helpful so how about this Um, looking for a medical professional. <coughs> healthcare. 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 Again, why did I? Sorry. Because pregnant women are not sick. They don't need medical true, attention. Of Thank you for explaining. Now it's going to stick <laughs> in my head. Look for a look. Looking for a local healthcare professional who not only speaks your language but is also. <clears throat> working in your best interests uh um i like i like that ethically, ethically uncompromised it's very powerful okay but i want to write it again not as questions um families abroad helps ex that mothers or mothers to be find local healthcare professional <coughs> that speak your language but but that are also ethically uncompromised. What do you think of that? This is a little more advertising me hey there must be a better way are you looking for a better mop you know this one <laughs> said is, uh, is more uh, matter of fact and it's shorter right i think i will go with this if you agree with the text yeah uh, yeah so let's throw this away expect mothers or mothers to be find local healthcare professionals who not only speak your language but but are also ethically like around. That, that can link to a page where you talk about your vetting process, uh, the credo, and all that good stuff. Okay. Yeah? Yep. Uh, no, I want the other one. Nice circle. Out more. Nice big video button. Uh, and then here, maybe just a big giant um, sign up for free. That's our. That's the action you want them to take at this point. Mm -hmm. um, so there's that. And then what we could do is below the fold, so to speak. I'm sorry. We oh below the fold. Below yes. the fold. We could add things like we offer uh, resources, blah, blah, blah. You know, uh, basically a reasons to sign up. 
We offer the resources, and then here I'm just gonna add some more uh, some Some random text for now. Um, What do you think? I think it's, uh, yeah. They can watch the video, they can sign up, and then if they need more information, they scroll down and there's text and uh, images and more videos and more, you know, basically marketing copy of what you guys do. Okay, and this is on our sign-in page. This is not our landing page. That's the home page right here, yes. Okay. Do we have in there meet our professionals? No. Yes, 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 we, yes. Let's do more. Let's do more. Uh, let's do the. the let's let's um, let's flush this out then. I was uh, I was thinking maybe you didn't want to, but we can. No, no, you, I'm. No, no, that's fine. Okay, reasons to sign up. Blah blah blah. So here, I don't want to. I don't want to add all the text. But yeah, what are the actions here that people do? That people um, can do? Uh, search for professional. Oh, okay. Yeah, browse or search. Yeah. Uh, okay, so I'll, I'll add that, and then so it'll be something like that, and then we'll do another title. Another button. Where am I? Oh yeah, I'm gonna go this way. Okay, so how do you search? What what are how do you envision people searching? Um we can say do you need and then we have different um uh, categories right. we have midwives do you would, would you like to speak with a gynecologist would you like to meet with a midwife do you need a lactation consultant okay. do you need Tell a doula? They are. okay uh each of the um categories we've got we've got a few we want them all oh, just a few okay pediatrician gynecologist Midwife, lactation consultant. I don't know how to spell gynecologist. That's okay. It depends if you're British or not. Oh, okay. I'm Italian. <laughs> <laughs> so, a pediatrician would be the default, right? Is the first one? Uh, probably. Gynecologist, maybe even before that? I don't know. I would put midwife before gynecologist, but okay. that's because we work in uh, midwife-led care here in that's Rome. Fine. Okay, so here I'm looking for a So this is interesting because um, how do we sh how many more are there? Uh, there's a few. So if it, if it's getting too heavy, um, no, no, it's fine. Let, let's put them in, and then we can decide how to how to show uh, them. Okay, so we've got lactation consultant. Uh, we have um, therapy. Okay. Um, we also, <laughs> and you you tell me when to stop. We have uh uh in-home uh blood samples and in-home sonograms uh an, um what do we call them analysis what are those one word no test uh, blood test no test medical test mm -hmm. uh healthcare test yeah right now i'm calling up all i'm coming up with it is an italian control uh -huh. check -ups. Check -ups. Check -ups. No, that's different. Oh, sorry. That would be a doctor. This is someone who actually comes and takes your blood or someone who comes and performs a uh, sonogram. Um, is it different people or would it be one? Two different people. Oh, one okay. is, uh, what do you call it? One is uh, echographista and the other is uh, 
a guy, a vampire. Okay, that's good. <laughs> vampire. <laughs> okay. Okay, so um, I'm gonna change this to be a a. I don't know if I can do this combo box. Ah, oh, this software is awesome. <laughs> Who makes this software? Must be a pretty cool guy. Some pretty good people. All right. It's funny that it surprises me. Okay, so let me see first of all that we're not going too far. That it's got to fit in the phone. Okay, so here we put a. Let's do it this way. Browse our providers for okay. So once they pick, um, actually, to show it better, I'll do it this way. This close. Because if they click here, it will pop up the, the phone thing, you know, the picker on the phone. Uh, the uh, yes, picker, where is that? This guy. You know what I mean? Oh, scrolly guy. Scrolly guy. Yes, that's the yeah. technical term. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, so it will be like that. Okay, then once they pick, how do what do they do what else do they have to write or do they just see a list well they have to pick their their location exactly. right uh their location not well for our mvp no because our mvp is rome oh it's just rome okay. for our mvp yes okay so uh matters to uh but maybe that's something it makes sense to build in from the get-go. Where are you? Um, yeah, we could do that. We could do that. So, so we could do leave a little space in, and then here we'll just do something like this: combo box roam, and we'll make it disabled because it's only roam. <laughs> <laughs> you can pick Rome or Rome. Rome or Rome or Rome. Uh, we could do something more. Cities coming. Soon. There's other thing. 